Just want to give another shout out to Rise of Kingdoms for sponsoring today's video. Jambo is a big fan of them. Oh he yeah. The game all the time. Look, look at him. Oh playing my right God. Now. He's playing the game right now. Let's be real here for a second. Okay, there are few mobile games with worse ads than Rise of Kingdoms. And the most offensive part is that they're literally fucking everywhere. So you can imagine my surprise when I clicked on Jay Schlatt's latest video. He has literally nothing to do with Rise of Kingdoms at all. I thought finally I could watch a video on YouTube and not be reminded of Rise of Kingdoms. I'm not even two minutes into the video and today's video is sponsored by Rise of Kingdoms, baby. Now, if you don't know who Jay Schlatt is, you're probably living under a fucking rock, but he's basically a content god okay he was part of the dream smp and if there's anything that i've learned in the last six months if there's someone on twitter who's blown up out of nowhere it's probably because of dream smp now he hasn't posted minecraft content on his channel in quite a while thank fucking god but even still it seems like he's pretty much everywhere on twitch and he can't post a single tweet on twitter without getting at least 200 000 likes so you might be thinking omniarch who gives a shit what's the point of this video with rise of kingdoms ads being so shitty is it possible that jay schlatt can make a good rise of kingdoms ad now i'm somewhat of a connoisseur on shitty rise of kingdoms ads so i think that i'm the most qualified to make this call so let's go ahead and take a look before we begin i've saved up over 100 gold keys that we're going to open up at the end of the video and we're going to see how many sculptures of ragnar i can get also about 80 percent of you guys are not subscribed so make sure you get on there and click that button all right enough of my bullshit let's take a look today's video is sponsored by rise of kingdoms baby rise of kingdoms is a mobile strategy game that puts you in control of your very own civilization true enemies are invading and it's up to you to keep your people safe Safe. Okay, everything up until now has been great. This cinematic is one that many Rise of Kingdoms players have seen before, but it's actually an incredibly good cinematic and it's super fucking epic. They're waging a badass war, everything's going good, and the best part is that there's no fake gameplay, there's no clickbait bullshit, it's just a badass cinematic. And Julius Caesar on a white stallion, what's not to love? Choose from 12 different historical civilizations, mm. recruit hundreds of real generals, hundreds. train your own soldiers, and save the day. So this is why I have fucking trust issues in case my therapist is watching. This is not Rise of Kingdoms gameplay. I know it might look like this could possibly be the gameplay because they misleadingly put the UI over top of the footage. Now, this is close to what the game sort of looks like, but that doesn't matter because anybody who downloads the game because of this footage is going to be sorely disappointed. Also, there are not hundreds of generals in this game. There's literally 68 commanders. That's it. There's only fucking 68. Also, can you believe Schlatt maxed out Barker? Didn't you see my video talking about the top six worst legendary investments in Rise of Kingdoms? And for the love of God, put your talent points on your commanders if you're gonna max them what are you doing train your own soldiers and save the day this has got to be the most depressing footage in the entire ad because this footage looks fucking awesome i wish my troops looked this badass on the battlefield dude it's just oh my god it's what could be you can upgrade your buildings train your troops and research new technologies to kick the ass of anyone who stands in your way there's just something intoxicating about schlatt telling me to kick people's ass in rise of kingdoms i'm so wild up right now actually this is probably the most accurate screenshot of the entire ad this this is the whole game. This is the whole. This is ma maxing out your tech. Is the whole thing. Fight battles whichever way you want. Oh with my Rise God. of Kingdoms advanced combat that looks mechanics. So good. And link up with other players around the world in your alliance oh. to become even stronger. Seriously, you can play this game however you want. Wow, however I want? Talk about fashion, a hundred thieves shirt covered in cat hair. That's the definition of sex appeal. Again, this footage is actually badass and it's close enough to the actual game footage to where people might download it and then get super disappointed when it doesn't look this incredible. But at least it's not some fake bullshit CGI with a terrible story or with women getting kidnapped or losers getting kicked off of cliffs. Also, you gotta love the Cleopatra Garrison boys. Cleopatra, the new meta. Sit down, Zenobia. We got a new bad bitch in town one of the clips they wanted me to show was called uh attack enemy city from 10 <laughs> sides uh you can guess how well that went oh yeah oh my god rest in peace yuki with the yadviga garrison you should have used cleopatra you absolute idiot this is an important screenshot because this is the only time that you see real gameplay footage in the entire ad which means there is more real gameplay footage in this rise of kingdoms ad than any other rise of kingdoms ad i've ever seen also i love this part because i've worked with some mobile game companies and this is literally how the file names are actually saved on their google drive actually that's not true it's usually all in fucking chinese but anyway you get the point point. and now take our 
on adventures with the all-new Viking civilization. True. You can lead legendary Viking hero Ragnar Lothbrok and Bjorn Ironside no. from the Luar River to conquer the world. You can download Rise of Kingdoms now for free using the link in the description. Then use code ROKVIKINGS to get a bunch of in-game items. Holy shit, Ragnar Lothbrok, no way! Honestly, they've been advertising Vikings like crazy and it's one of the best things that's happened to Rise of Kingdoms in the last like year. Tons of new players are joining because of Vikings alone. And how could you not with badass footage like this? Too bad the game doesn't fucking look like that. Also, this was such a tease. I think this only works for brand new players because I typed this in game and I didn't get shit. Also, be sure to check out the second link in the description to enter into the contest to win one of these iPhone 12s. This is actually pretty cool, guys. I'll make you a deal, okay? If this video gets 10,000 likes, I'll give away one iPhone 12 to a lucky subscriber. I know, I know, I'm a shameless whore, but like and sub and you'll have a chance. Thanks again to Rise of Kingdoms for sponsoring today's video and enjoy guys our boy did it ladies and gentlemen an actually good rise of kingdoms ad i know what the f but wait there's more believe it or not you actually haven't even seen the best part of his ad hey guys editor schlatt here just want to hey, editor schlatt just want to give another shout out to rise of kingdoms for sponsoring today's video jambo is a big fan of them oh he yeah the game all the time look, look at him. oh he's my god he's playing the game right now oh This big guy right here, best part of the ad. It's genius. God, I really need to get my own tax deductible cat. All right, this is the part of the video that all my Rise of Kingdoms viewers have been waiting for. We're gonna pop open over 100 gold keys and try to get ourselves some Ragnar. Ragnar's actually not that great, but who cares? His beard looks fucking badass, so let's see if we can get him. All right, baby, first gold key going in. Let's see what we get, and it is absolutely... Actually, this is all pretty useful stuff. Even as a late game player for me, this is all pretty much garbage. So let's go ahead and keep opening these. Let's see, we got our boy Gaius. If you don't know anything about Gaius, he's garbage, actually. You're gonna use them mainly for gathering. Let's keep going. Let's see what we get here. We get Lancelot. He's complete trash. We got Osman. That's not good at all. We haven't gotten a single legendary commander. Good. Look at that. All books of knowledge. Nobody needs those when you're my hive. Hive of love. Okay. That doesn't matter. Sarka. What's with all these books? Do they really think I need all this? Okay, there we go. Get out of here, Lancelot, you piece of trash. We got Frederick, okay? He hasn't uh, been maxed yet, so this is uh, some legendary commander sculptures that I can actually use. Thank God for that. Let's roop open another gold. There we go. Okay. Oh, God. I got excited there. Charles Martel, this you know for pretty much anybody else this is the best thing you can get from these gold keys but the problem is i expertised him a long time ago so we got an extra hundred sculptures just chilling we get oh shit dude let's go this is probably actually this is probably the best thing that i could have gotten from the gold keys i have still yet to get a 5511 mulan it's literally taking forever but it's okay mulan we forgive you you're beautiful you're badass yada yada let's keep it open these holy shit Holy shit, call her beautiful and she comes back. Let's see what happens. I love it. Oh, oh my god, I thought it was her again. I was going to be super excited. This is actually good. I'm pretty close. I need one more skill to finish Sunduk. She'll be expertised for the rest of time. Okay, the perpy boys, they're not exciting to me. I don't really care. We got more garbage. This wood is fine. The, the gold stars are pretty good, to be fair. And the universal speed ups. I'll take those as well. There it is, boys and girls. We got 10. We got 10 Sunduk. We are so close to expertising her. I can taste it. Look, you put Schlatt in the thumbnail and you get a bunch of beautiful women surrounding you. It's crazy. It's absolutely nuts. Are we going to get another Sunduk on this next rip? We're not. We're just ripping through these. We're, we're really just looking for anything golden. There, there it is. We got a dazzle. Okay, get out of here, Pelagius. We don't need you anymore, okay? We're looking through for the gold stuff. That's the most important things here. There it- What? What? Dude, no way. We are getting so close. We are getting so close to expertising Sunduk. I cannot. Oh, ooh, that was probably the best gold key in a long time. That blessed dazzling starlight sculpture. Let's see. We haven't gotten literally any Ragnar. We haven't gotten any Ragnar yet. It's kind of heartbreaking if I'm being completely honest with you. We got more Martel, which again, would be exciting to some of you or most of you, but really we're, we're trying to see if we can get Ragnar and where is he at? Okay. I thought he was like the new hype commander. What's going on guys? Like, what? come on, come on. On. you're advertising this badass new viking and i haven't gotten a single one of them we're going through like what 50 50 keys already and we get like 400 lancelots there's another martel like why couldn't i get this many martels back when i still needed to expertise my martel i think it's kind of rigged if i'm being honest with you guys I'm, i think these gold keys are rigged they give you a ton of the gathering legendaries they give you a ton of the legendaries that you've already maxed out and you just don't get the cool stuff like ragnar and mulan now i got lucky in this video i got lucky with mulan but i still cut the conspiracy andy in me is kind of thinking that this is sort of like a ripoff you know what i'm saying i mean look at this we haven't gotten a gold thing in a long time okay okay we got some more freddy 
We got some more Freddy. That's fine. We still have to expertise him. He's still pretty much useless, but at least it's going towards progress on something that slightly matters as opposed to all these purples that are just complete trash. And of course, all the blues. What is going on with Martel? Martel absolutely loves me now that I've finished him. It's obnoxious. It's annoying. And I bet you guys, if you are trying to open gold keys for Martel, you probably don't get this many Martel, right? You probably don't because you need him and therefore you won't get him. But me, I don't need him anymore. So they're going to give me a ton of them. So that's it. It just, it is what it is. Okay. That's how the cookie crumbles in this game. And of course it's bullshit. Cleopatra, we finished her as well. We're more than halfway done here. We are more than halfway done. Not a single Ragnar. Not a single Ragnar. We got Mehmed. I love that, dude. I love Mehmed. It's only two, but I do love Mehmed. He is definitely one of the better gold key commanders, in my opinion, because you can actually use him in your canyon team in early game, and it's fine. Ooh, we, oh, we got more Mulan. It was only two. Okay, it's only two, but it is what it is. There's some Bjorn, so we got a little bit of a uh, Viking action going on here, but not the Viking that we're really looking for, okay? But we've only got 32. There it is, dude! We got another Mulan! We got another Mulan! This is lit. Again, this is lit literally the best thing that I could still get in these gold keys, right? It's not Ragnar, which was originally the goal here, but we've got what, like almost 30 Mulan sculptures in this video. Like that's actually hype. That's actually good. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting so many Mulans. Usually I get ripped off. So here we go, boys and girls. That's awesome. Let's get out of here. Sarka, you're, you're pissing me off. Okay. We've got more Mehmed. I love that. I'm seriously not going to get any Ragnar. Clearly the game doesn't like me. They don't want me to have good content. Elsid is nice though, because Elsid, I'm gonna, you know, he's a usable sort of gold key legendary, right? Pseudo usable, I guess you could say better earlier on, too late sort of for him now, but it is what it is. I haven't maxed him, so it's still useful sculptures towards somebody. CPO coming in here, coming in hot near the end. My man with the biceps, absolute hunk. We got more Mulan. We got more Mulan. That's absolute. That's amazing. I love that. That's awesome. This is, it is what it is. These, these gold keys are, you know, Lancelot, seriously, get out of my face, dude. Get out of my face, bro. You, you're coming too close. I could feel your breath on me. It's just annoying. You keep popping up. I can't believe, oh my God, we got another legendary summon of a commander that I don't even need. I don't even need Cao Cao. I expertised him first. This was my first expertise legendary. Really, I can't believe it. I can't believe no Ragnar. This is my last gold key. This is the last gold key. This is my last shot. I'm, I'm going to close my eyes. Can we get a Ragnar, please? Oh my God. Complete garbage. I got ripped off. I didn't get a single Ragnar sculpture all video, but we're one step closer to a 5511 Mulan, boys. Let's go. Anyway, guys, that's it. I just thought it was really cool that Rise of Kingdoms actually sponsored a content creator that I think is actually good at making content. And this is the result an actually good Rise of Kingdoms ad. Can you believe that? Guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a thumbs up on it. I wasn't kidding. I'll actually give away an iPhone 12. If his hits 10,000 likes, one of my subs is going to get it. For full transparency, that's way more likes than any of my videos have ever gotten. But who knows? Maybe you guys can make it happen. As always, if if you're new around here make sure you subscribe to the channel and click that bell to be notified the next time that i upload a rise of kingdoms video comment down below was this the best rise of kingdoms ad i'd love to hear from you do it for jambo of course if you want to play rise of kingdoms on your pc there's a link in the description below it's a program called blue stacks it's absolutely free and it's my favorite way to play rise of kingdoms plus it's a free way to support the channel and if you don't like it you can always uninstall it later as always my social media links are in the description below so make sure you follow me over there on instagram facebook twitter discord all that stuff it's always down below and with that being said guys thank you so much for watching this has been on the archive we'll Talk to you guys again soon. Peace.